up to Brandon Ingram. Jalen Brunson drives in, hooping and scooping. I'll tell you, they showed that highlight of uh, Illy's basket. Sensational. Here's Brandon Ingram. Put USA basketball on that dominant track back after the 2004 Olympics when he hired Mike Krzyzewski as the head coach. Great body control. But, you know, we talk about teams in this group that have had certain strengths or advantages with their depth. Look at the USA bench. This is 10 as they adjust to these new experiences here at the World Cup. And Bankera makes the second, closing the gap. Again, with Bankera at the five, it's a five out offense. Bankera catches it, goes up. It's going to be tough to stop. Caro, who passes up the reeds. And great hustle down by Halliburton to get the two for Bankero. Halliburton. USA with a chance to take the lead. Look at the run. And Rees knocks it down, the three-pointer. And the USA. So again, Tarangi stepping into that shot with confidence. A miscommunication between Reeves and Johnson on the coverage. Were they switching? Was there real coverage? Taranga made a pay. And Portis, after good work from Reeves. To be fair, you could say the same for New Zealand right now. They've been outstanding. They lead it 26-25. Halliburton. You can count it! So many weapons, Jeff. Reeves up ahead to Edwards. Oh. oh boy, what a move to the basket. Bridges in the corner. You know he can hit that shot. Here's Jackson. Powers his way up over Wenzel. When he gets oh, they're trying to get those quick shots up so they're not blocked, but it's affecting the shot. Look at Bridges. But again, look at Brunson with the ball ahead in transition. In there. Look at Reeves, goes behind his back. Oh, boy, he's tasty. What the Tall Blacks decide to do. USA with possession here at the start of the second half, and Jackson scores down low. Good sign for the USA. Nice job coming out of halftime. Anthony Edwards quickly up the floor. Now he steps back, puts it up and in. It's a two, but the lead is biggest now, 13 points. Or maybe they're not worried about it. If he fouls out, he fouls out. Here's Brandon Ingram. Follows up his miss. Brunson for three. That's good. So again, Ingram can be a, a really impactful score for you. Zealand have cut it to nine. Oh, what a spin. Look at Brunson. This is what makes him for two. And it's back to a 12-point game now. And New Zealand not going quietly. Thir just under 13 minutes remaining in the game. Banquero pulls up at the elbow. So Jeff. Wow. Reed steps back. Now Banquero wide open. Oh boy. What can you do? You kind of got to pick your poison. Jackson. Oh boy, Jackson. Halliburton feeling it in transition. Three spins. Back to Jackson. Oh, look at Jackson! A little bit of thunder from number 13. <laughs> Zone out of the timeout for New Zealand. Halliburton. Oh, yeah. So, wow. That was the most emphatic block of the night. Here he is. I mean, he's he's just sensational tonight. <laughs> Probably for every other team he plays for, foe two. Brunson makes a second, and he'll get a third.
just exceptional in the press conference the other day. Brunson talking about how pressure doesn't really feel pressure when he goes out in these big games. He just just trusts in his miss. Hearts, you can count that. Edwards was excited the other day, wasn't he, after that Germany game, saying he hadn't had that much fun in a long time. Coming back, Bancaro just, just put an exclamation mark on his Comes in to bring the rim protection to the USA. Bridges puts it up for two. I think they're going to pull it up as they cross mid-court. Okay, I'm wrong. Johnson's going for it. And they get it to 99. Bridges, another deuce for him. Flynn Cameron pulls up. So that's how it's finishing. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.